here is how you can hide notifications on your iPad. So before we get into it, make sure you are subscribed to this channel as it really does help me and it's going to make sure you won't miss future videos. So make sure to locate at the settings app on your iPad. And in here on the left side, you can see a bunch of different stuff in here and you want to scroll down to find the notifications, which is in this like red icon. And in here you have some options. So you can choose how they're going to be displayed, right? So there is this the first setting, then you have the previews and stuff like that. Then, then you have the Siri announcing notifications. Obviously everything can be tweaked as much as you like, but to actually hide notifications on the iPad, what you got to do is to find the specific app which you want to tweak. So every single app which cannot deliver notifications on your iPad is going to be listed in here. So what you're going to do is to, for example, find app which you want to just turn off, right? The notifications for, uh, for example, in my case, it can be the game center. Let's say I don't want to use it. Uh, I just want to hide the notifications. I can disable it entirely. This is going to get the job done. I don't have to worry about anything else. However, I might keep it on, but let's say I don't want to just see it as a banner or in the notification center, right? So this is another option. So you don't have to just quit it cold turkey. You can just, you know, disable the sounds, badges, or some other individual settings. And there is also the option, which I briefly mentioned called previews. And this is quite interesting because in case you want to hide some notifications, perhaps you still want them to be delivered. You only want the content to not be visible. And this is what the previews are for. So the previews, for example, you receive an email or a text message and in the pop-up, in the notification, you can see a little preview of what the message actually says. And sorry about that. And this can be managed in here. So for example, when unlocked means that on the lock screen, it's not going to be available or perhaps never or always up to you to decide, but these are the settings. So yeah, this is all that you need to know about it. Hope you found this tutorial helpful. Hit the thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'm going to catch you in the next video.